Hello everyone, in this video we will try to uh, challenge ourselves a little bit, not that much, but a little bit. Let's start some problems and so up to this point we were learning about, about how to insert components and how to do uh, property analysis. Now let's start to do some uh, problems. Here we have a, a problem. Uh, it says a uh, mixture uh, contains 50 uh, acetone, 60% by weight acetone and 50% by weight water is to be separated into two streams. One rigid in acetone and the other in water. Uh, the separation process consists of extraction of acetone from water into methyl isobutyl ketone and which is preferentially dissolved acetone but is nearly immiscible with water. The overall goal of this problem is to separate the field stream into two streams that have a greater than 95% urity of water and acetone respectively. So here here we have the our objective it says the mixture of uh, a feed stream of 100 uh, kilogram per hour of 50 50 acetone were mixed with the solvent stream 100 kilogram of methyl isobutyl ketone so here we what our objective is to mix the acetone water uh, and the solvent I methyl isobutyl. So let's uh, plot uh, like some. So imagine this we have here we have like. Uh, we have two input stream and we have two one output stream uh, this is a mix, uh, mixer uh, this is a mixer and this is uh, acetone uh, plus uh, water and this is methyl uh, iso methyl ketone so we have these two, two streams. Uh, this is 50-50. Uh, this one is 50-50. 50-50. Uh, this one is 100% uh, methyl isobutyl. So this is an output. This is our product. So let's uh, go to the component part. We have water and we have acetone and we have methyl isobutyl ketan so let's continue Mm, let's select the uh, energetic property method. Mm, next, click on next button. And next button, then go to the simulation area because we are going to do some flow sheet and block diagram. So before we were just doing only the property analysis, and we are going to utilize uh, so some equipment and also some more. So let's select on mix. So you may name the name of the block mixer, and we can give. Uh, so we will click on material and we can bring the 
cursor here and I'll wait till the color change then I will hold on it I can move up and down to my objective area so then I can move my cursor so you can see this one is a color plus uh, water and then I will do the same thing for the next string then this one is the tile as well, the tile kit. So, and so the red, uh, the red arrows are they are mandatory. So at least we have to uh, fill those red buttons. So this is the output that means water uh, asset one plus water plus. Um, Plus, um, so then if I want to make this uh, streamline straight then I will hold the control button and I will press the B then it will become straight line so uh, just using the control button and uh, so up and down and left and right uh, arrows on our keyboard so we can minimize and so we can enlarge and we can minimize our streamlines and also if you want to like enlarge this uh, mixer so you can click on the mixer and I can also enlarge the mixer still I can use the uh this uh control and up and down uh, arrows on, on my keyboard so let's so to fit the data on the streams and on the blocks so we have different alternatives i can go here and i can fill it here just uh, i can click on here uh then uh, i can fill uh, so let's fit the temperature is the room temperature and also the pressure is uh, the room pressure and I can say this is mass flooring so on the water and uh, and let me check if I missed something on the this so on this line uh, So let me feel here. So this one is twenty five and, and one atmosphere and also this one is mass flurry. So and the problem that's given with the mass flurry is it's also mass and the water and the acetone stream become only filled for water and acetone but there we have we don't have this uh, metallized hotel kit and so I will go back to here to the, uh, the block and so I will fill this on the metallized hotel kit and stream I have 100 uh, kilogram per hour metallized hotel as a solving this goal uh, as a fee to the make, uh, mixture so it's in terms of mass flow so these are zero zero we don't have uh, this water and acetone in the retail isopotail so next uh, it says there's something so temperature is uh, missing and pressure is also was missing so so next so says all get input is completed so I can run the process so I can go to the main flow sheet and or I can check here uh, 
to see the result. Yeah, see the result available. So you can check the results here. Also, I can another alternative. I can right click on here and I can go to the result area. Then I can check. Uh, I can cross check uh, if the things are uh, normal here. You know, we can see mm, the on the water and as it on stream. So there is water and 50 50 and also there's no uh, mid tile as a tile and the uh, water and the acid stream so here we can see that our input uh, mass is conserved 100 and the uh, solvent stream and 100 was in the mixture stream so we have 200 and also we can check cross check the mass fractions the mass fractions you can see 0 0.5 by here it's one only the solvent you can see 0 0.5 0 0.9 see that so you can also see the volumetric flow rate here and also we can see all the mole fractions so you can see the mole fraction here and so the mole fraction of the output so you can see this is the output mole fraction this is the input mole fraction and also we can see the mole uh, for each component so uh, here we can see the mole for each component in the mixture and the mixer and then the output so this is uh i'm trial exercise or uh, for we will see on the next videos we will do more challenging problems so for now this will be quite enough i have a good time